It's so good to see everybody, um, Rachel and uh, Marsha. And by the way, there will be no drama in this room today because you two are straight up gangster. That's all I'm going to say. Thank you. I, I mean, that. this that's a huge compliment because this movie, you two are some special. Um, it tends to watch. I swear my heart was pounding. My hands were getting sweaty. It was just, <laughs> it, this really was a thrill. Um, Rachel, first question for you. I mean, it's quite a, an a acting, you know, a different acting experience for you. I mean, this is not Mrs. Maisel in this movie. No. <laughs> you know, what, what made it so different for you? I mean, almost everything about it. It, it uh, you know, Mrs. Maisel is a very fast paced comedy and um, and this is a much more deliberate and quiet drama. Uh, this was also my first foray into producing. So I played a few very different roles on this project and it was um, it was really exciting. I love them both dearly, but it was it was really fun to be able to head in a totally different direction. Marsha, um, I love the fact that it's such the the female characters in this movie are, are strong. They're tough. Yeah. Uh, you know, there's a lot of action, which I'm going to ask about here in a second. But, you know, well, how important was that for you to, to portray playing your character, uh, Terry? It is one of those things where you, because normally I think you don't really get to see a vulnerable side of a tougher girl character. Um, and actually in the pace of this film and how everything is lay, laid out and the nuance of it, you do get to see that there are so many layers and that even Terry's toughness is coming from a place of vulnerability or experienced vulner vulnerability, right? Where she's now gotten to be tough, but she wasn't always like that. Um, and I love the idea of that. I love that we're, we're seeing someone who is claiming her femininity, who's claiming the strength that is in that, but we also understand that it took her a little bit. It took her a while to get there. Um, she wasn't born that way, you know? And um, and I and I think that's what that's what opens the film up for for it to be experienced by everyone. Is that like these are women who are confused. We have a woman who is not a natural mom by any means, and we see her become that over time. Um, and we and then we we have this woman who is the supporting character who is for all intents and purposes um, coming to help, but she's not natural at helping either. Rachel, you know, this story can scare us and it, it is a scary film. It's intense to watch, but you know what? It can also inspire us. Uh, tell me a little bit about that in, in your, in your mind, you know, as you look at this story, how can it inspire us? I think there are a number of ways, you know, looking at Jean, this is a woman, an ordinary woman who is thrust into extraordinary circumstances and rises to the occasion and discovers that she had this power and this strength, as you said, inside of her all along. It's not something that appears out of nowhere. It was in there. Um, and I think it's inspiring to know that that journey is always possible for anyone at any time. And also that for women like Terry, you know, Terry's a survivor. She's been mm -hmm. through this. She's coming out the other side and in a, in a different place from Jean, but still starting a new chapter. You two should be really proud. This is an excellent film and I just thoroughly enjoyed your performances. Watched it with my mom and we both were just like freaking out in a good way. So thank you for your time. Stay safe thank and I'll you, see Dave. you all next time. I appreciate thank it. Thank you. Thank you, mom. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> she, she loved it. <laughs>